Hello everyone. In this video, I'm going to do a comparative study of conventional bricks and environmental friendly bricks. In this comparative study, I'm going to talk about red bricks, AC block and fly ash bricks. This study will help you in making the right decision for the wall of your home. So here are 10 points for making the comparative study. 1. Environmental effect. Red bricks. Red bricks is not a green product because it is made by mixture of clay, sand, lime, iron oxide and magnesia. If clay is continuously used for making red bricks, in future it reduces the top fertile soil cover. Hence the land available for agriculture gets reduced. Here red brick emits more amount of carbon dioxide during the manufacturing process. AAC block. AC blocks are made from the mixture of cement, lime, gypsum, little amount of lye ash and an aeration agent. AC block waste is recycled and used again during the manufacturing process. The AC blocks are comparatively lighter in weight and stronger than common clay bricks and fly ash bricks. In AC block, less amount of carbon dioxide is emitted in atmosphere during the manufacturing process. Fly ash bricks Fly ash bricks are made from the mixture of fly ash, cement, sand, lime and gypsum. Fly ash bricks utilizes fly ash waste which is generated from the thermal power plants. Thus, it helps and solves the disposal problem. In fly ash bricks, very low amount of carbon dioxide is emitted during the manufacturing process. 2. Water usage during manufacturing and construction. Red bricks. Red bricks require more water for curing and hence there is high amount of electricity bill and labor cost. AC block. AC blocks are cured by steam and AC block masonry also requires less water during curing. So there is a saving in electricity bill. Fly ash bricks. Fly ash bricks are cured by steam and thus requires less water during manufacturing. But these fly ash bricks use water just like red bricks during the masonry work on site. 3. Termite resistance Red bricks are not termite resistant. They are made from clay which is an organic material. AC block AC blocks are termite and pest resistant as they are made from inorganic material hence it increases the life of the wall. Fly ash bricks Fly ash bricks are termite and pest resistant as they are made from inorganic materials. 4. Sound insulation or noise transmission Red bricks The brick wall has good sound insulation property due to its dense structure. AAC blocks The AAC block has good sound transmission property due to the presence of avoids. Fly ash bricks The fly ash bricks have moderate sound insulation properties. 5. Breakage and utilization Red bricks. In red bricks, average 10 to 12 percent or even more breakages happen on construction site depending upon the quality of bricks. So 100 percent utilization is not possible. But in AAC block and fly ash bricks, there is negligible breakage. Almost 100 percent utilization is possible. 6. Dry density. Red bricks varies from 1600 to 1920 kg per meter cube which varies according to the class of the bricks. AC block varies from 451 to 1000 kg per meter cube which varies according to the grade of the blocks. Fly ash bricks varies from 1700 to 1850 kg per meter cube which varies according to the class of the bricks. 7. Compressive strength Red bricks the compressive strength for red bricks ranges from 3.5 to 35 Newton per mm square. AC block Depending upon the density and grade of AC blocks, its compressive strength ranges from 2 to 7 Newton per mm square. Fly ash bricks For fly ash bricks, the compressive strength ranges from 3.5 to 35 Newton per mm square. 8. Thermal conductivity Red bricks the thermal conductivity of brick is high. AC block Thermal conductivity of AC block is lower than red bricks and there is less heat transfer from the AC block. Fly ash bricks Thermal conductivity of fly ash brick is more than AC block but less than red bricks. 9. 
water absorption red bricks water absorption in red bricks should not be more than 20% of its weight ac block water absorption of ac block should not be 10% of its weight fly ash bricks water absorption of fly ash bricks should not be more than 15 to 20% of its weight 10 cost and mortar consumption red bricks they are cheaper as compared to other masonry units however overall cost is more because they require more mortar due to irregular surfaces and more number of joints ac block in ac block individual block is expensive but the overall cost of ac block masonry is low as it consumes less mortar it saves cost of the steel fly ash bricks the fly ash bricks are cheapest masonry unit but the overall cost is more as they require more mortar this study will help you in making the right decision for the wall of your home from the above comparison of red bricks ac block and fly ash bricks you can choose the right environmental friendly bricks as explained this red bricks are made from natural soil if this natural soil is continuously used for construction in future the natural resource will become scarce due to this reason alternatives such as ac block or fly ash bricks can be used for constructing a wall so that's all for this video this is arpita signing off thank you so much for watching